Mohamed Abdikuti today took the oath of office and immediately pledged to revive stalled projects in the vast county. The former cabinet minister who takes charge of the Siolo County government joined local leaders in outlining key priorities they want to see addressed. The leader of Majority Edin Duale, Foreign Affairs Cabinet Secretary Amina Mohamed, and the chair of the Council of Governors, Josphat Nanok, were among the dignitaries who graced the colorful event in Isiolo town. Carol Derry was there for us. It was Isiolo County's turn to usher in its new governor, Dr. Mohamed Abdi Kuti, who has previously served as a senator and two-time member of parliament. The tents pitched at the Isiolo Stadium shielded a multitude of people who turned up to witness the inauguration of Isiolo's second governor, Dr. Kuti, who trounced former governor Godana Doyo. However, Doyo skipped the event, and the former deputy governor, Mohamed Guled, is the one who handed over the instruments of power to Dr. Kuti. Dr. Kuti and his deputy governor Ibrahim Abdi Issa took oath of office and pledged to work together to improve the lives of the people of Isiolo, a cosmopolitan county that is home to five major communities, namely the Borana, Turkana, Samburu, Meru and Somali, as well as other smaller communities that reside in the county. Do justice to all, so help me God. All elected leaders of Isiolo were also present at the swearing-in ceremony. Fatuma Dulo, one of three elected female senators in Kenya and the only elected female senator from the pastoralist community, said peace and cohesion in Isiolo was of utmost importance. Isiolo has long been hard hit by insecurity. She also urged local leaders to unite. Mumeli Giza Katika Ile Wazungu Walasema Guinness Book of Record Najua Shida za Isiolo Sia Barabara Sia Maji Sia Hospitali Sia Kazi Yote Najua other elected leaders, Isilo North MP Hassan Oda, Isilo South MP Abdi Koropu, Woman Representative Rehema Jaldesa spoke at length about Isilo's prosperity, a region that heavily relies on tourism and pastoralism as its economic mainstay. Hakuna maji. Najua watu wa basa pia wako na the same problem. Utajarimu pia kwa tikisha kwa wama kuna dignity. Sisi tuko tayari kufanya kazi pamoja. The victory is ours. As we all welcome you to assume the leadership of this great country of Isiolo. What was Isiolo, it cannot be business as usual. Wacheni ku pigana mufanyie kazi watu wa Isiolo. Sisi tukiongoza na Mheshimiwa Uhuru Kinyata tutasimama na Isiolo. Sisi kama baraza la kikao cha madabara. Tukitaka chaguliwa tunachukua ofisi. Siasa yetu ni maendeleo. Siasa yetu ni ugatuzi. Na tukiingia mhula wa pili mimi nikiwa chama being an arid area, the leaders admitted that their work is cut out for them. Dr. Kuti was the last of the governors to be sworn in in a process that began last Friday. Their hope is that the new government will ensure that peace and cohesion is attained as well as economic prosperity and that the government of Isiolo will fulfill its mandate to the people of this cosmopolitan county. Carol Derry, reporting for KTN News in Isiolo County.